This is your DNA. Now, wouldn't it be wonderful if there was an aid to help you identify your very own individual genetic predisposition to fitness, sport, ideal diet and nutrition? Stuff of the future, you might say. Well, guess what? The future, it's already here. You can go in for a DNA fitness analysis. A simple swab from your inner cheek will reveal information to help determine your potential and needs based entirely on genetics. A report like this will help you to optimize your training time and achieve your best possible results. These tests will tell you your genetic power or endurance potential, injury risk, recovery speed, personal post-exercise recovery nutrition needs and your aerobic potential, as well as reveal incredibly in-depth information including ideal diet suited to your genes, carbohydrate and saturated fat sensitivity, lactose and gluten intolerance risk. In fact, you can have a personal shopping list based on your ideal diet which you can acquire from your favorite supermarket. It also reveals your body's detoxability and antioxidant needs, your personal micronutrient requirements and your salt, caffeine and alcohol sensitivity. <sighs> Sounds pretty complex. So is this test a difficult one? Not at all. It's a simple case of taking an earbud-like swab just running it along the inner cheek, popping it into an envelope and sending it off for analysis. And within just a few weeks, you should have your result. Having the ability to know our own personal genetics is exceptional in many ways. But as with every strand of the current trend for the quantifiable self, caution must be exercised, as the value of this knowledge can also be too easily overstated. When it comes to DNA, understanding our genes is indeed an extremely important step, but in itself, it is no more so than our environment, how we live, how we eat and how we exercise, for example. A champion athlete arrives at a gold medal through not just natural talent, but in most cases, also a lifetime of sacrifice, hard training, mental strength, appropriate nutrition and ultimately, a little bit of luck too. This means two things. Firstly, genes alone are not fully predictive and secondly, we can intervene with specific actions to improve the outcome. At least, that is the hope and the promise of understanding personal genetics. Taking the sum of the data regarding physical performance genetics, it is possible to assess where this information suggests that a training regime, for example, could be modified in a personalized way. Genetic results can be interpreted to give an idea of what is more likely to be the most effective strategy. As such, this science is certainly not at a stage where personal genetics should be advocated as a method for talent selection. Rather, it should be used appropriately to individualize training and nutrition strategies to better achieve your goals, whatever they may be.